who's ranked what, um, and we won the game. So that, that, that was the most important thing. But, uh, you know, he's taken some criticism, and, you know, that's a part of the profession too, and we all understand that. But as players, I think we kind of get a chip on our shoulder too, and I take that personally because that's my coach. And so um, I think that's a little extra motivation for us to go out there and play hard too. Do you sense that it wears on him at all, or is he just like that to he, I mean, he can't let it wear on him because we follow his lead, and so um, we've got we've all got a mentality next play, and so uh, we got this next game mentality, and we got to put what's in the past in the past and uh, prepare for the future right now and go out there and win a game. What's the biggest challenge? Um, think challenging things going to be managing the tempo, and uh, you know you get looks at practice, and so we'll try to get good at that, and then uh, the dual threat is going to be something to deal with too, but um, you just got to prepare to be in the best spot for that too. I think Clemson, I think their two losses, I think they've turned the ball over 10 times, I think, total. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you guys knew that or not, but I mean, obviously turnover is always important, but I mean, does that take on a little extra this week? Because you want to get them off the field really any way you can, I imagine. Yeah, but you, you can't really, I mean, you want to force turnovers, but you can't press because then you'll end up out of position and all that kind of stuff. You just got to play sound defensive football and that kind of stuff will happen. Do, do you feel like you guys have gotten the turnovers you've wanted this year, or would you want that to be? I mean, obviously, you always want it to be higher. But yeah, I mean, <laughs> you, you want a few more. I think we've done a decent job. Um, but, you know, there's always one more game to go out there and, and try to do a little extra. Yeah. yeah. What's the mindset of this team coming off its first loss in two years? Get a win. Uh, so go out there and prepare really hard. And I think just uh, trust coaching and um, think all the things will fall on the line. Certainly the defense has gotten a lot of criticism the last two times out. What have you guys done since that Michigan State game to maybe correct some of those things? We worked on a lot of fundamentals, um, and I think that will help a lot because if we can get good at the stuff that we know how to do, we won't have to install a whole bunch. And so that's going to be it. we got to play sound uh, defensive football. we got to tackle. Um, you know, we gotta you gotta have some awareness, and we gotta play fast. We know how good Ryan is on the field. Describe Ryan Shazier off the field. What's he like? He's a great guy. Um, you know, he's one of those guys who's always trying to get the linebackers together, spend some time. And so we've we've got a really close bond because of that. Uh, you know, guy's got a big heart, and so anytime someone's down, he's looking to pick someone up. Um, and he's been a really good guy to get to know over the past couple of years. Uh, ever since I first came in, he was there to help me right along the way. So, uh, you know, he's one of those guys that I look up to definitely.